bed. The need to improve the living conditions of the soldier by assigning him a decent bed resulted in the publication in 1860 of various provisions approving a single model with which to equip all troop dormitories. By these resolutions it was established that, during their stay in the barracks, each soldier had to be provided with a mattress with 25 pounds of wool, a pallet with 30 pounds of esparto grass, hay, corn or long straw. An iron bed with an upper headboard resting on two stools with a foot in the center, a headboard, two sheets and a wool blanket. In 1862, by circular of April 30th, it is established that the military bed consists of three or four boards, which must have each one in the first case the width of 28 centimeters, 2 centimeters thick, and 2 meters and 10 centimeters long. The need to provide decent facilities to the barracks, especially as far as the troops' dormitories are concerned, will cause a multitude of articles and studies that, in the end, will bring about an important modernization of the military installations. This need led to the publication of the Royal Circular Order of July 7, 1926, by which the rules were dictated to adopt and declare a new bed and a locker for the troops, calling, urgently, a competition for this purpose. Dot.